Hello, this is Ralph Roberts, and we're coming to the junction of uh, 212 for Highway 208. Turn right on North Carolina 212. And we're going to turn right on 212 and go up into the Shelton Laurel area of Madison County. Very remote still, even Drive today. Drive 2.2 miles, then turn right on Chapel Hill Road. Very remote area, even today, of the very famous massacre, the, the Shelton Hall Massacre took place here during the Civil War. It is still remembered, sort of uh, the Civil War's My Lai incident, for those of you who remember that uh, occurrence during the Vietnam War. A lot of history up in here. And, uh, as I said, it's still a remote area. I was talking to a guy up in here uh, <clears throat> a few months ago, and uh, he said, we're so backward, we still have dial up internet. <laughs> I thought that was pretty good, and it's true, most people these days have cable or DSL or something. So this is uh, Highway 212. We're sort of paralleling the Tennessee line here. We're very close to Tennessee, within <clears throat> eight, nine miles or so, I think. In fact, if you stay on this road, you go on over into uh, Dry Pond, Tennessee. And in fact, if, if you're going to the upper end of Shelton Royal, as I do sometimes, it's easy, it's faster to go out to uh, Interstate 26 into Tennessee and come back into uh, uh, North Carolina on this road. <laughs> However, today, wow, that river sure up. We had a lot of rain the last few days. Uh, however, in uh, my appointment today is uh, at the lower end of Shelton Wall, so I came through Marshall and down Hot Springs Mountain and over to uh, across 208 to uh, 212 here. Shooting this with my droid, looks like our uh, inmates are out working from the North Carolina Department of Corrections. Good to see them doing something. There they are, up ahead of us. <laughs> They're out picking up trash and stuff. Yep. in a marching formation there with the guards at either end. Oh, there's water on the road there. What was I saying? I, I lost track. Oh, my appointment's at the lower end of Shelton Law, so I came this way. And it's uh, pretty nice up here. This is a uh, rather large <clears throat> in remote mountain valley. There's still only one store in the whole, one little convenience store in the whole valley, and, and that's it, that's simply it. A number of little towns, so although they usually just wide places in, in the road, Revere, Cutshaw, Wintertown, and the like, Chapel Hill itself, which reminds me of a story uh, somebody up here told me once uh, about using the GPS. There was a guy uh, coming down uh, from up north with uh, one of those big car carriers, big 18 wheeler that had new cars on it. And he was going to Chapel Hill, North Carolina, which is, of course, down where the University of North Carolina is, near Raleigh. But uh, he was coming down uh, Interstate 81. He punched Chapel Hill Road or something in his GPS. So he wound up going up this road here and then turned on to Chapel Hill Road, which is a lot more narrow than this and uh, run, eventually running off the road, so uh, you can't just listen to your GPS and take it verbatim without knowing exactly where it is you're going. So, I claim that's a true story. I don't know, but it's a good story. I love it up here. I love coming here. It's, it's neat. My kind of country. I'd be out in that river. I'll stop and film the river.
Imagine what this was like back in the 19th century when all the way up through here was on a horse and wagon and over what probably just a narrow wagon road through here. A lot harder than it is today, that's for sure. But there's still not many people from, say, Iceland, even though areas like this exist still. back up in the hills. According to the GPS, I'm uh, 1.1 miles from Chapel Hill Road, which is where I'm at coming, but I've got a much smaller vehicle than the guy did in the 18-wheeler. <laughs> oh my. I, I, I've been on that road a lot. I can make it. Four wheel drive, I can go anywhere in Madison County and often need it. The four wheel drive, that is. This is a beautiful drive any time of the year, but especially in uh, spring and fall, it's, it's absolutely gorgeous up through here. All the blooms in spring and all the uh, colors of the fall foliage in the fall. 2.4 miles. Turn right on Chapel Hill Road, then arrive at address 1, on Reich. And bam. I'm actually not going to 1, but when I put in the actual address I was going to, this is Laurel School, it's elementary school. Uh, it tried to send me over some back Turn mountain right ways. on Chapel Hill Road that I knew were, was not a good idea to go on. Oops, that's not where I'm turning. Pay attention, that was the schoolyard. The actual road turns up here. Another, another prison bus. Okay, here we go. I wonder... Uh, Arriving at address one, on Rice. I wonder the uh, guys got off. Uh.